Hey everyone, what's good? How are we doing? Welcome back to the channel. And today we will be reacting to episode seven, season two of Link Click. All right, so in our last reaction, I, I think we're starting to figure out now that the sister is probably innocent and that it's the brother that's the one doing the killings. It's just, we still haven't figured out how he got that power yet. He met some kid when he was younger that we haven't seen the face of, the kid that like jumped in the fountain. And I think that kid might've been like the kind of catalyst for the brother to go down the path that he did. And the episode ended off with um, Chang running away with the sister out of the police station. We don't know where they're going, what they're up to, but I'm locked into the plot of season two. Like I'm on the edge of my seat the entire time. So I can't wait to see how all of this plays out. All right, so before we get into today's reaction, if you wanna show me some support, be sure to hit that like button if you have not done so yet. Smash that subscribe button, hit the bell for notifications. Friendly reminder, I do have a Patreon. These link click reactions are a full week ahead and on cut over there. So if you wanna get early access, stuff go check it out the link is down in the description below all right so with all of that out of the way let's get it wait that looks like the sister with him through the back alleys wait so is it the sister killing people i don't know we uh, i'm just gonna stop talking rely on other means Yo, the way she's looking at this police woman. I'm scared. I have such an uneasy feeling right now. <laughs> Wang smiling. Dude, she's got to be possessed right now. Bro, I don't know who's... Who's evil or not? <laughs> what the hell is going on? I was so sure the sister was like not evil. <laughs> I don't know. We still haven't seen the brother yet though. So maybe he's like, I, I don't know. <laughs> what the hell is going on? I was so sure the sister was like not evil. I don't know. Maybe he's like, if I heard this, I'd be like, all right, I'm moving. Someone here can possess people? Yeah, I'm out. Yeah, there's like no way to know if you're pos if someone's possessed or not. That's the scary part. Oh, that's Lou getting abducted. That's right. I forgot he got kidnapped. Yeah, and he's not in there. Damn. Through the window. What happened? Did he get possessed or did someone break through the window and take him? <laughs> we have bad news. <laughs> what if this is what the ex-detective was talking about? Maybe it was talking about Lugain kidnapped and the police would be on him and he has to take him through the back alleyway. I'm not sure. I love when they throw these drum and bass tracks in. The, the OST for this show is so goaded. Yeah, they went across the street into that shady looking alleyway. Dude, I love the song that's playing right now. It's so good. Oh, there she is. Oh, she's handcuffed. But why was she smiling earlier? That's why I was so, like, sus of her. She has no clue. Yo, so she was possessed. What the hell was that about? Did her saying that, like, let her possess her or something? Oh, they got a GPS on Chang. That's clutch. I still think they're like, they're baiting us. I, I, I feel like Chang is fine. The sister's not evil. I don't, but who was that in the car with the ex-detective? Oh, here they are. Finally, we're picking back up with them. See Chang's? Oh, his eyes are red. I think he's possessed as well. Where are you? 
Yeah, Shaolin, stay put. You are not ready for this. Who is rolling up on Wong, though? And of course, he made other arrangements. So she's getting jumped. Yo, these guys got weapons. Oh my. <laughs> this is not This is not good. Who is this sussy man walking up to them? Oh no, that guy's gonna find the tracking device on him and take it off. No. No, this is so bad. And there goes the GPS tracker. <laughs> Dude, this is going downhill. I thought I was for sure thought the sister was nice. I guess not. <laughs> the way Chang was looking back smiling. Oh no. I do not think this guy's gonna let you buy. Yup. Oh my god, he threw how strong is this dude? This guy is massive. I do not think this officer's winning this fight. Oh! Let's go, Wong! <laughs> dude, she's got hands! Yo, the kick off the wall? You every female character in this show is badass. Oh, yo, the sound design. Oh my god. Yo, she is sick. What do you mean a police woman would be easier? Bro, you got a knife. You should win this fight. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Dude. I love the sound design of these fights. It sounds so brutal. Oh, the uppercut to the jaw. Oh, to the... <laughs> Do the combo! Oh no. Oh no. Don't do it. Wow. Okay, maybe this... Maybe the, the police in this show are just nasty. Oh, he's got to take the mask off. <laughs> oh, dude, the fight's not even over yet. Yo, this POV shot. Bro, when I started this show, I was not expecting to get fight scenes like this. Dude, she is so sick. Oh no, this guy's really about to throw dirt in her eye. This dirt's about to F her up. There it is. Oh my god. Oh, wow, she deflected that? Oh, but he's about to go again. Dude, <laughs> the fact she like evaded the dirt the way she did, she is goaded at fighting. Oh, let's go. Knock the knife out. This guy sucks. <laughs> He's lost two fights in a row now. This guy knows how to fight, man. He's beating the ass of a guy twice his size, too. The spin, the 360 kick. This is brutal, dude. Oh my god, dude. Punches and kicks for days. <laughs> dude, all right. Yep, he's 100% winning this fight. Another uppercut. Wow. Dude, the police, whatever training the police are going through in the show, it's working. Oh, why are you laughing? I don't know. I think Wong's doing pretty good for herself. Although, it might go south right here. Oh my god. No, he showed up. Dude. That's so annoying. No way he's about to offer. Oh, the other, the other uh, detective's about to show up. Dude, there's no way. There's absolutely no way. No way he killed her. Dude, there is no way she dies like that. Oh, dude, the tears coming out of his eyes. 
Dude, this police guy is going through so much trauma himself. He's lost two partners already. What do you mean sound like it's going according to plan? Shut up. Dude, I was so for sure that the sister was nice. What is happening? Oh, she caught up to them. We're going by boat? Where are they taking Chang? Oh? Wait, why does he have that face? Wait, is that Lou driving the boat? It is him! <laughs> what is going on? Oh, let's go! Yo, Lou just showing up out of nowhere! Oh, Chang's knocked out of it. Let's go. Yeah, but Lou's got a stab wound. What is he doing? Oh, dude, I am so confused about the whole sister thing. I was so sure she was not killing people, but now I have no idea. All right, so this was episode seven, another crazy episode. Almost the entire episode was fighting again. We're getting so many firefight scenes in this season, and they're animated so well, and the sound design especially is crazy. Like, hats off to whoever does the sound design and like sound effects for the show uh because they're killing it but it seems like i was completely wrong i thought the sister was completely innocent she wasn't the one killing people i thought it would be her brother the one thing is though we still haven't seen the brother in the present time yet we've only seen him through the flashbacks so we don't know where he is or what he's up to my one thing i'm thinking about is he has pink hair he has the same color of hair as the sister so like he could be like impersonating her but I, I'm not, I don't know. It, it's it's too hard to like really confirm what's going on, at least from my perspective. Maybe I'm just an idiot. But yeah, I I thought the sister was, was a, a good guy. As of now, she isn't. I don't know where they were trying to take Cheng on that boat, but somehow Lu Guang showed up. So like, how did Lu get there? Last time we saw him, it seemed like he got kidnapped out the window, but maybe, maybe he broke out the window himself to try and save Chang from what was going on. Um, either way, the plot is still super good, still on the edge of my seat. It sucks that the Wong girl died. Um, it wasn't like fully confirmed. It just showed her head get bashed in. But if that one officer died by throwing himself off the roof, I, I think it's probably safe to assume Wong died as well. That sucks because she was going to town the entire episode. Um, yeah, but we need to figure out what's going on with the whole sister and brother thing. We need to figure out where the brother is. What is he up to? Um, and like, what was with the whispering shit? Like he, she was able to possess Wong by whispering something to her. I was kind of confused about that. Maybe that's how the power works. Um, but either way, we still got a bunch of questions we need answered. And yeah, I can't wait to finish this season out. We're already up to episode eight. So we, we only got like four or five episodes left. So I'm hyped. Let's see. Let's see what's going on. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's reaction. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Remember, stay blessed, not stressed out there. Hope to see you in the next one. Peace.